Susan. And I'm Grant. And today we're going to be making a project that was all Grant's idea and it's so fun. It is rubber band helicopter. Woohoo! This is so exciting. Are you excited about today? Yeah. Yeah, this is cool. Grant's been waiting a long time to share this project with you. He's done a lot of prototypes to make sure it's just right. Should we show them what's in our bag? Yeah. Okay, cool. In our bag, we have an outline for the helicopter body, two rubber bands, tape, a popsicle stick, one paper clip, and a propeller. That's so cool that we have these propellers, isn't it? Yeah, and these propellers were actually built to fit on popsicle sticks. That's, so that's perfect. Kind of on top of everything you got in your kit today, you'll also want a pair of scissors to cut out the helicopter, of course. And just optional, you don't have to. You might want some markers or crayons or colored pencils or even stickers to go on your helicopter if you want to decorate it. Okay, once you have that, let's get started. Okay, I wanted to color mine. What about you, Grant? Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna put like a helicopter window here. That's my idea. Oh, were you gonna do that too? And what did you do on yours, Grant? Um, I did red and green racing stripes, cool. propeller, and a really cool stick man pilot. A pilot, that's awesome. Go ahead and start cutting out your helicopter. The shape of this is actually really important. Very good, we have it all cut out and we're ready to build our helicopter. The popsicle stick fits perfectly into this little insert right there, nice and snug. Okay, next we're gonna take our paper clip and you're going to hold on to the big part and pull down on the little part, like this, so it's flat, making an S. This is important. You hold that middle area where that S curves and you bend the little part back up. That way when we secure it to the popsicle stick, there will be this nice hook right here for our rubber band to attach to. Grant said while he was prototyping that if this tape isn't tight enough, it won't be able to withstand the force of the rubber band and the rubber band will pull it apart. So you wanna make sure that tape is nice and tight and secure. Maybe even do a couple of layers yeah. just to make sure. Okay, and then also Grant wanted to, us to secure the propeller to the popsicle stick with some more tape. It's not necessary, but it could be really helpful just in case so that our propeller doesn't detach from our popsicle stick. So let's do that too. Okay, next we're going to flip our helicopter over. So we're showing the opposite side of what you've colored. And then we're gonna put our popsicle stick on top of that. And notice the hook of my paper clip is on this side, so it's up. It's showing up here, okay, so that you can Put the tape right across your helicopter. I'm done. I'm done too. I did a bunch of extra layers because I want this to last quite a while, a lot of playtime. Do you remember the first couple ones you did? You didn't do that and they fell apart after a little while? Yeah. Okay, so you're gonna hold your helicopter this way and make sure your hook there's a little space here where you can hook on your rubber band. Make sure it's facing this way so that you can slip your rubber band right into that eye of that hook. We're gonna stretch it around that paper clip down there. You can try one rubber band or two rubber bands. What have you found that works the best, Grant? Two. Two works the best? Okay, I'm gonna do two. If you guys wanna do one or two at home, we always encourage experimenting. The energy of this rubber band is being used in two ways. First, spinning the stick around and spinning the propeller around. We want all that inertia that's in this rubber band, meaning all that motion, we want it to be diverted into the propeller instead of the stick. That way the helicopter can fly higher, which is the whole point of flying the helicopter, right? You might think it's okay to not have that paper on there and just have it like this, and we've tried it that way too, haven't we? Yes. And what happens? So it'll just go about like this far and then it'll drop. The reason that's happening is because this rubber band has so much energy in it, it's going to find the path of least resistance, which is this popsicle stick. So it's going to just turn and turn and turn that popsicle stick without turning and turning and turning this propeller as much. 
but when you put the piece of paper on there, it creates some drag. Okay, some drag this way, lateral drag. And with the lateral drag, that makes it harder for the stick to turn and easier for the propeller to turn. So it'll go a lot higher. And it makes it look more like a helicopter. Yeah, totally. Obviously. Yeah. So if you want, you can experiment with different papers at home. The cardstock paper or note card paper works the best. And you can try different designs. If you have a paper that's too big, this propeller won't be able to hold it and it'll just not take off at all. If you make it too small, then it's just gonna have no resistance and then it's just gonna flop away to the ground. But you can experiment with different designs of helicopters or body styles. You can even make it look like a bird or a plane, like Superman or something like that. All right, to wind up our propeller, we've gotta take, I just like doing this with my pointer finger and winding it around and around and around. And it's gotta go clockwise. See, this is the way the clock goes. Put it counterclockwise, it's not gonna wind because we'll just go up, down, up, down, and it's not gonna wind at all. Oh, but it's only designed to be turned this way. You wanna keep winding it until you're starting to get that overlap of the rubber bands where it's getting really wound up. Do you see that? Let's see yours, Grant. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> so ours are all wound and ready to go. Now, one more tip before you let your helicopter go. Don't let go of the propeller and the stick at the same time. What'll happen is the weight of your propeller will pull your helicopter down before it has a chance to get that lift. So if you let go of the propeller and then let go of the stick, that's how you'll get a better lift. Like the time how you say, winkle. Okay, that's cool. So I'm letting go of the propeller and then I'm saying winkle and then letting go of the stick. Try Okay, it. ready? Winkle. Whoa! And I think we're ready for this helicopter to take flight, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, that was so fun outside flying our helicopters. It was a perfect day. The weather was nice. Good luck with your helicopter today, everybody. We want to see your videos. We want to see your pictures. We want to see how it turned out. Have so much fun flying your helicopter. Maybe someday there'll be actual helicopter pilots, or you could be a helicopter engineer and build these things. Wouldn't that be awesome? Yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye. See you next time. Woo!